Hey guys, this is JJ Inc. 24 here today with a quick test of the Notifier SFP2404 um, fire alarm control panel. Um, here's the outside of it. It has a black cabinet, um, white controls, and yeah, it's um, really just rebranded uh, MS4. So let's open it up really fast and we will take a look inside. Alright. So as you can see, we have the typical uh, instructions on the door, and then coming in here, um, for each one of the zones, there's a fire alarm, supervisory, trouble, and maintenance light on them, and then down here we have all the indicator lights, and you can see that I have a system power trouble for the battery on this right now. Uh, but moving on here, all here are all of the diff switches that you uh, do the programming on. Um, right now, I have it set to uh, system sensor sync protocol, and I have selective silence turned on. And then up here we have, I'm just using some old wires for this system, but uh, we have our two bell circuits, um, four uh, four zones. Uh, right now, what I have hooked up. This is my ADT 5050-001, my FCI, um, what's this, P24110FC Spectra Alert Classic Horn uh, Strobe. So let me grab my keys, and we'll do a, a quick test of this. Sorry, they were stuck in the lock for some reason. Alright, anyway, here we go. Alright, we have that acknowledged and silenced, and once again, since it's uh, running on selective silence, um, the strobe is still flash flashing. Alright, so, reset this pull. And reset the system. Well, okay. That was kind of weird. Um, really fast, I think I'm just going to uh, test the walk test feature on this panel. So, I think I have to hold it for a second. There we go. Um, yeah, go ahead and open this up. Alright, and I have that closed, so we'll go ahead and reset this again. There we go. It's kind of hard to push down the buttons on this panel. Alright, but anyway, that's all. Thank you for watching, and have a great day.